Hello everyone. In this series of the video, I am going to talk about genetic basis of inheritance. Okay. So, the continuity of the life on the earth is possible due to remarkable ability of living organism that is to reproduce. Okay. At the time of reproduction, living organism transfer character from one generation to the next generation okay they reproduce by various methods like vegetative reproduction asexual reproduction or sexual reproduction and at the time of reproduction the characters are transfer from one generation to the next generation or from parent to offspring okay and due to this the offspring show some similarity with their parents but they are not exactly identical with their parents okay and due to this many question arise like how exactly these characters are transferred from parent to their progeny or parent to their offspring and why offspring is uh, not identical or they show some differences when compared with their parents and a reliable solution to all these questions or all these problem is given by genetic okay if we want to know the definition of genetics then first we have to study two important thing that is heredity and variation heredity is generally defined as the process of transmission of character from parent to progeny or from one generation to next generation and variation is nothing but the differences which are present in parent and their offspring okay so in genetics both these terms are included we can define genetics as branch of science or branch of biology that deals with the study of heredity and variation okay, how character are transfer from generation to generation and why offspring show some variation when compared with their parents is generally studied in the branch of biology which is called as genetics the term genetics was first time coined by william battison in 1906 the genetic word is nothing but the greek word which mean to grow into okay this is the meaning of genetic word and this word is first time reported or coined by william battison in 1906 then the first scientific explanation of the term genetic was given by gregor johan mendel mendel was genius much ahead of time he found that characters are transfer from one generation to the next generation through factors now we call them as genes okay so mendel report this factor before the discovery of microscope or mitosis and meiosis so he was much ahead of time and he found this thing by performing a classical experiment called hybridization experiment mendel start his work on pisum sativum 
that is garden pea plant in 1856 okay and then he report his finding uh, in 1865 okay now in his study he proposed some postulates or principles now famously known as mendel's law of inheritance so mendel satisfactorily explained how these characters are transferred from generation to generation and why there is a variation in between parent and their progeny and on the basis of his postulates three laws were designed called as mendel's law of inheritance and the laws are law of dominance law of segregation and law of independent assortment okay mendel laid down the foundation of foundation of genetics so we know him as father of genetics after 19th century many scientists work on different organisms and they found some variation or some deviation in mendel's ratio or in mendel's law in different organisms which come under the heading deviation deviation of mendelian inheritance okay so the life is possible on earth due to reproduction which is the characteristic feature of living organism and at the time of reproduction this organism transfer character from one generation to next generation but still uh, the transfer of the character offspring shows some variation from their parents and, and that is due to genetics okay the answer to the this problem is satisfactorily given by george john mendel who work on pisum sativum or garden pea plant in his famous hybridization experiment and he proposed three laws called mendel's law of inheritance so in this video series i am going to first talk about biography of grigor john mendel okay so in next video we will going to discuss in detail about the early life of mendel and his work uh, which he done on garden pea plant then uh, in the next half of this series we will going to talk about mendelian inheritance okay in mendel inheritance i am going to talk about different point like mono hybrid cross then di hybrid cross then three laws of the mendel called mendel law of inheritance then test cross which is also developed by mendel and back cross so in mendel in inheritance we will going to study all these things while in the last section of this series we will going to talk about deviation of mendelian inheritance Okay. as i told earlier after 19th century many scientists found some deviation uh, in the mendelian ratios which is called as deviation uh, of mendelian inheritance and in this point i am going to talk about incomplete dominance co dominance multiple alleles pleiotropy and polygenic inheritance right so in this video series 
we will going to discuss in detail about the biography of gregor john mendel then his work which mainly include mono hybrid di hybrid crosses three laws test cross and back cross and deviation from uh, mendelian ratios which include incomplete dominance co dominance multiple alleles pleiotropy and last that is polygenic inheritance thank you